Hi everyone! Welcome back to another episode of Hero Spotlight. This week, a new hero will meet us on the Land of Dawn, the Akuma Ninja, Hanzo! He used to be an excellent ninja of the House of Akakage. With the pursuit of being the Supreme Ninja, he betrayed his oath and companions, stepping onto a road where he could never turn back. Hanzo uses enemies' blood and soul to feed the Ame no Habakiri, the seventh forbidden weapon. With the help of the blood demon in his body, he performs supreme ninjutsu to become death itself. Hanzo can travel within the map at will, ignoring any obstacles. Even when you manage to kill the blood demon, Hanzo's actual body will still exist in the battle. Unlocks after five basic attacks. Hanzo uses Ame no Habakiri to devour a target enemy unit and digest them over a period of time. Doing so regenerates Hanzo and gets him extra demon blood. It can only be used against creeps and minions. It deals true damage if the target is Lord or the Turtle. If the attack speed is fast enough, each attack of Hanzo can unlock two stacks. Hanzo opens the soul portal to deal damage immediately. The portal then causes damage every several seconds. Every time the portal deals damage, Hanzo will recover a certain amount of demon blood. If Hanzo steps into the center of the portal, he will take back the area and achieve extra demon blood. This skill ensures the laning ability of Hanzo. Try to make full use of it when Hanzo takes back the area in order to obtain demon blood faster. With the help of the blood demon, Hanzo becomes the supreme demon ninja and achieves demon blood. When the demon ninja is killed, Hanzo will return to where the blood demon was, stunned and weakened. This skill consumes demon blood, and once it's used up, Hanzo will speed up gradually, seeking for demon blood, and take him back. Try to hide Hanzo's body in the safe area. When facing Hanzo, to find his body and kill him is also a good way to counter him. Unlocks temporarily after five basic attacks. Hanzo summons the Demon Thorn that is full of demon blood power to attack enemies in a designated direction, dealing several percentage of the target's max HP points of physical damage to enemies and regenerates demon blood. Damage decays when targets are non-hero units. If the attack speed is fast enough, each attack of Hanzo can unlock two stacks. Use this skill accurately and impress enemies by its fearsome damage. Hanzo transforms into Demon Puma and dashes towards the designated place, dealing destructive damage within this area. Each time of damage dealt to enemies will unlock a stack. It's the main skill for Hanzo to get enrolled in the team fight. Use this skill and the Blood Demon returns to Hanzo immediately. Reap with no harm taken. That's Hanzo's specialty. Return to the real body when the demon blood is running out or the body is under attack. When units are eliminated nearby, the blood demon absorbs their souls into its body to use as energy. Even when Hanzo is in a defensive status, he can also recover demon blood depending on his passive. The sufficiency of demon blood is a must for Hanzo to perform attack or escape. We recommend these three sets of equipment items, among which the third set is highly recommended, as Hanzo has a good ability of farming in the jungle with his skills, and the third set improves his ability to gank. As for emblems, Assassin Emblem is highly suitable for Hanzo because it provides physical penetration and therefore increases Hanzo's damage dealt to the most. Hanzo is good at reaping, so the Bounty Hunter talent can widen the gold difference between him and his enemies. Retribution is a good choice for Hanzo because it enhances his jungling ability. At this time, the team fight is reaching an end. Enemy heroes are all with low HP and skills cooling down. Hanzo turns into the state of the Supreme Demon Ninja, uses his second skill, Ninjutsu Devastator, to come close to enemies, dealing damage and unlocking Demon Thorn. Another enemy hero uses Flicker, trying to escape. When they're close to the enemy turret, an enemy hero decides to slay Hanzo, even if that means being eliminated. Hanzo uses Ninjutsu Devastator and avoids damage from the turret and kills the enemy without hesitation. What an excellent reap! And that's our new hero, Hanzo! 
pick him up for 599 diamonds or 32,000 battle points. Be sure not to miss out on 30% launch week discount. Until next time, we'll be seeing you in the Land of Dawn. Download for free. Mobile Legends. Bang Bang.